Hey guys, it's out of here with my Nokia blog, and this is just a really quick video. Uh, a lot of people have been asking me how to get the Facebook messaging app, the standalone app for Windows Phone, and uh, a lot of people don't seem to realize that it's actually available for Windows Phone 8. It's, there's a standalone app on Android and iOS which allows you to open only the messaging aspect of the of the app, which opens your inbox instantly. And that's actually available on Windows Phone 8 and Windows Phone, Phone 7 devices, and it's actually built into the official Facebook app. So all you have to do is download the official Facebook app, this one, or Facebook Beta. If you have a Windows Phone 8 device and you're using that, I suggest you download Facebook Beta. And basically what you want to do is just head to your and inbox. And once you have your messaging inbox open, you just hit the pin tile option, pin to start down here. So once you hit that, you'll have the Facebook messaging tile stuck on your Windows home screen. And uh, you can change the tile size. There's two tile sizes. There is no double wide tile, but it's a quick shortcut that when you run it will open your inbox once again, and it'll open straight in, straight into the inbox, and backing out will take you to the home screen. So it's a way to bypass the, uh, I guess, the full Facebook interface. So it's a really cool option and alternative to using the Facebook messaging chat. Uh, true, it does take. A bit to load. Uh, I guess that's just a Facebook beta app. It's in the works, but it's a really cool app. Um, it's a really nice shortcut. Hope you guys liked the video. Um, do you guys know this trick? Do you have any other useful tricks for using Facebook on your Windows phone? Let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, subscribe, and see you guys around in the next video. Thanks for watching.